What's up, Squirrel Squad? Here I am at uh, Wendy's. I want to try the new breakfast. So uh, here's what I got. I got the uh, the Baconator combo. So it's the Baconator sandwich, which is uh, like sausage, cheese, egg, and bacon. Um, I did get a coffee, and I got their small little potato wedge gimmick. Um, there's basically potato wedges. Um, the coffee is ice cold. Um, it's cold ass coffee. Um, I don't know. I was hoping that I'd find a place that had good fast food coffee. But uh, this is not very good, so let's, uh, let's try out these uh, fries. Let's do a quick review here. Very reminiscent of um, Kentucky Fried Chicken Potato Wedges. Um, very similar. Cold as well. Um, I just walked over from the counter. I literally just got this. In case you're wondering, Six forty nine is the price for the meal. Um, when you go to order it, they ask if you want medium or large. I said medium, and then it rang up like seven nineteen plus tax. And I said it says six forty nine on the sign. They said, well, that's for the small. And so he didn't ask me for a small. And they said we're not supposed to. We're only supposed to offer you medium or large. So be careful if you're just looking, you know, to stay within the budget that's on the sign. You got to order the small. The yeah, wedges are okay. One second, let me unwrap the sandwich. I'm right back with you. So here's the sandwich. So yeah, I mean, uh, looks like it has mayonnaise on it. Oh, is that mayonnaise? I fucking hate mayonnaise. I said nothing about mayonnaise. That's gross. As you can see, the bacon looks pretty uh, pathetic. It doesn't look like um, it does in their picture. Picture shows like crispy bacon hanging out all over the sandwich. This is not, this is like loose, like, I don't know, gross looking bacon. The bacon underneath looks a little bit better. Um, and we're sticking with the square theme with the sausage. So, a rubbery looking egg. God, I hope that's not mayonnaise. It's so fucking, who puts mayonnaise on a breakfast sandwich? Who doesn't tell you that there's mayonnaise? I'll, I don't know, I'll eat it and try to tell you what it is, so. Let's uh, just give it a whirl. Potato wedge in between here. All right. the top back on. It doesn't um, it doesn't appear greasy, which is good. Um, bun isn't like sopping with grease or anything, so that's a big bonus. Let's have a bite. I don't know what that is on the bun. It might be mayonnaise. Ugh. Um, the egg is, is what it is. It's an egg. Uh, let's take another bite and get some bacon. Hmm. Final update here. The egg was kind of, I don't know, mushy and gross. So I took the egg off the sandwich. I'm actually just going to eat the bacon. Uh, the sausage is good, but it's way too spicy for a breakfast sausage. Um, I really enjoy sausage. I eat sausage biscuits from other restaurants all the time. This is just a little too much. Um, I don't know, it's almost like a forced flavor. But I'm going to eat the bacon and the potatoes. The potatoes are pretty good. And I'll drink my cold coffee and be on my way. Anyway, uh, it's not bad. It's okay. For the price, would I buy it again? No, not if I'm getting this. If I'm getting what's in the picture, maybe. This is, I mean, it's very underwhelming. The bacon's kinda, eh, you know. I don't know what this crap is that's on the bun. It's probably mayonnaise. I don't know. But it's okay. Um, overall, maybe a 3.25 out of five for the meal. Um, for the experience here at Wendy's today in Worcester, Massachusetts, bought it too. Um, yeah. I don't know. This is just one man's opinion. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, give it a try for yourself. Wendy is a good establishment. They got some good items on the menu. Um, maybe as they tweak the breakfast and get it better, or maybe there's some other items I'm sure that are just that it might be better. This was the big one they advertised. Very underwhelming, Wendy's. Very underwhelming.